All right, Grand Lake, Rusty Fleming. I'm the publisher of Grand Lake News Online, and this is this week's edition of Coming Attractions South Grand Lake Style. And this weekend, one of the biggest events is going to take place right here at Arrowhead. And joining me today is Brandon Sharp, sales manager at Arrowhead, who's very much involved in this 10th annual rendition of the event. Right, yep. Brandon? Absolutely. Can okay, you tell us a little about it? It is the 10th annual Boats, Bikes, Bikinis, and Barbecue. Uh, highlighting bikinis, of course. Of that's, course, of that's course, the yeah. Popular side of the whole thing, but uh, uh, Vink kicks off at 11, runs 11 to 4. We've got a uh, uh, we got Lickety Split, a great band coming out to play. We will be on the lower deck this year, so you can come and enjoy the event by water, or come and enjoy the event by land, motorcycle. And people like will have spent some time in the water, but man, you're going to get some weather. Yeah, <laughs> this is looking good. Yeah, it's looking really good, and uh, hopefully the uh, the bikinis will be out. And, yeah, and uh, it'll be fun. We have you know, time. there's been years that it's been 105 degrees, and you almost had to get into the water to cool off. But these conditions look to be ideal for yep. a great turnout for an event that benefits uh, South Grand Lake Beach children, right? It does. Uh, it's an event that was started uh, a while back. Uh, the, the Polar Bear Club has been going on quite some time, and this, this event is kind of in conjunction, conjunction with that. Uh, we raise money for, for local kids here in South Grand Lake area. And um, we started this off, I think, 12 years ago with the Polar Bear Club, where we raise money for Toys for Tots. Right. And we just saw that money go somewhere else, right. and, and uh, that wasn't as exciting to Grand Lakers as keeping it local. So. Uh, John and Edie kids here. Yeah, John and Helen Thomas uh, helped start this organization, South Grand Lakers Helping Children, and we are the fundraising side of the organization, and they do all the work. So the we fun raising. The fundraising. Yeah, side. it sounds like fun. Yeah, we, we throw the party, <laughs> and they do the work. So. And what about the food? Uh, the uh, our chef Mark has came up with some great items. There will be some ribs, some barbecue chicken, some uh, pulled pork sandwiches. So uh, some good options and. No, be fun. No, no reptiles running around no. on the lawn like have been in the past years. So. No, no, we don't. Uh, <laughs> and we are looking for vendors at this point. If you'd still like to join and, and sell some goodies, you're more than welcome. Uh, we just do a, a small donation, and, and you can set up a tent. Um, we usually have some vendors uh, um, that come out, and, and uh, the bike show and the boat show that kind of goes along with right. this thing is it's kind of just come at your leisure, really. I mean, we, uh, we invite everybody. And, don't discriminate. It's fun. We have a good time. So. And there's a live auction, right? There is. And there's a vacation giveaway that's done like on a raffle basis, right? Yes. Yeah, they'll do it. There'll, there'll be a Colorado uh, vacation giveaway um, that's done by Ty Harris's parents, which, by the way, this, this is a right. tribute to Ty Harris. Um, and then there'll be, there'll be live auction items. Uh, we've had boats in the past. Uh, we do memberships. Um, TVs, we've had, a, we've had all kinds of different things, and then silent auction items from uh, OU and OSU memorabilia, and, and uh, if, if you don't want to donate money, you're more than welcome to donate an auction item, and we'll, we'll put it in play and, and uh, raise some money. And, as far as the South Grand Lake coming attractions go, mm -hmm. if you don't like bikini, barbecue, boats, bikes, there is an ice cream social with the Queen Board that's just true. Okay. So just, uh, they okay. had, uh, Contact them about that. They're having a big deal over there, and they'll uh, they always have a, uh, a like large that. turnout. Yeah. Uh, that Coe's group, you never know what a ice cream social might turn into, <laughs> you know. But yeah. uh, in any event, the bikes, barbecue, bikinis is this weekend. It, it, it is for a very worthy cause, and Brandon mentioned uh, John and Helen Thomas, and they've got this thing down to almost a science. They get the bus, they go to Walmart, they work with the area schools in identifying the kids that really are needy, and uh, man, they get in here, they buy that stuff, they get it distributed, and it's a done deal. And, and they, buy the, they buy the stuff that's needed. I mean, we do have toys that are donated through the right. Polar Bear Club, but the money that we raise is spent on clothes and blankets and you know, shirts and socks. And Brandon, I'm always reminded yeah. of what Doug Cox told me one time, our state representative, and said, you know, in Oklahoma City, some of my colleagues say, well, what's it like to represent all those rich people on the Grand Lake? And he said, when you get about 500 feet from the shoreline, they're not rich anymore. Yeah, sometimes and you are a lot of them across the help. street. Yeah. Right, absolutely. Yeah. Okay, Brandon, thanks for joining okay. us. And uh, once again, South Grand Lake coming attractions. Don't miss the barbecue, bikini, and all the rest of it that goes along with it, or the ice cream social at the Blue Order Methodist Church. And we'll look forward to seeing you again next week. Thank you.